Hello, it's Tuesday the 13th. It's still pretty chilly. I'm still FX Blue and this is still the market brief. Uh, we had GDP data out yesterday and that showed that the UK economy bounced back a little. Uh, we posted half percent growth in October. That was after a 0.6% contraction in September. But one month does not a quarter make. Um, and analysts still expect negative growth overall, which means that we'll qualify for recession status. Uh, certainly all the strike action is bound to affect economic performance in some way, shape or form. Sunak's team are standing firm with the unions, though, and Hunt has supported that stance with his own sound bites that the claims are unaffordable and would start a wage price spiral that would be extremely difficult to break. Easy for him to say. Um, away from the picket lines, though, forecasts are leaning towards a 50 basis point rate hike from the Bank of England this week. Um, that would be pretty neutral for currencies, uh, as that is largely priced in already. Uh, there's a little more volatility risk centred around the ECB and the Fed meetings, uh, as the market is slightly less certain of the outcomes there. Uh, yesterday, the trading range was pretty narrow for sterling dollar. Uh, we topped out around the 123 mark on the day. Uh, we opened around 122.90 against the dollar, uh, about 116.45 against the euro, and euro dollar is around 105.50 this morning. Um, now, over in the US, all eyes are on the Fed ahead of their next rate decision this week. Um, I think it's fair to say that market expectation for another jumbo 75 basis point rate hike is a little lower. The general consensus seems to be expecting 50 basis points as a more likely outcome. Uh, the intention would be to help deliver on the Fed's forecast where they expect economic growth to be pretty sluggish for the first half of next year before GDP will start to pick up again. Those projections put an average of between one and a half and 2% on, on growth, but only time will tell with, on that one. Uh, the dollar index rather marooned yesterday as the market is waiting for all the central bank rate decisions. Uh, we closed around the 105 mark yesterday and we can probably expect another pretty flat day again today. Uh, the, the heating was out in my office yesterday. It was 13 degrees at my desk. Fingers crossed the engineers have got their, their act together today. Uh, I'll update you on that again tomorrow. All the best. If you do not have a clue, then just tweet through and ask FX Blue.